say small little changes, bit of time. Yeah. If you look at the old swing was, this is the one on the left is before that position there. Now the club is certainly now behind your legs, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Where we say we want the club to be more back towards the camera, over your toes, and when you did the wrist hinge up, it was this now. Oh, go back in frame, sorry. Is nearer. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So you were. That's where you are now. You were here yeah. in an ideal world we'll get somewhere towards yeah, there yeah, so yeah. you're moving back towards the thing yeah. and these, look at these two swings sort of frame by frame now this club now is through your elbow this one here now is slightly above your elbow so it's the yeah. difference in the position the club's a bit more upright with the wrist hinge yeah, yeah. you're getting a more upright set club it's less closed it's less flat it's less hooky all less of the stuff you had before okay so those two positions there sort of telltale signs when the club then comes back to the golf ball now as we come into the sort of impact condition that golf club now again is behind your body, whereas yeah. this one now with a bit club, a bit more upright in front of you. As we come into hitting area now, the club is now more on your legs, so it's just moving yeah. fractionally more in front of you. And when you come back to golf ball, the angle of attack now is more this way, as opposed to that way. Yeah, and the yeah. more inside you get it, the more left it will tend to go because yeah. the club just flips past. Yeah. And then to try and stop that, you try and swing it further right because the ball's ending up somewhere over here on a bad day. Yeah. You then slide your hips more and get stuck. It can do the old dreaded unmentionables yeah, or yeah. just a big slinging hook and you just can't yeah. aim far enough right nick on some holes. You, 10's a great hole, 11's a horrible hole, and it's just one of those things you're not going to be able yeah. to play the two holes back to back. So if we can get that sensation, that club's working more up there. So at this position now, what we'll be looking for is the club sort of on line with your toes over there. Okay, we're four or five degrees inside. Yeah. That one there's probably 10, 15 degrees inside. Oh, yeah. Ball flight showing that. Yeah, so we get yeah. a nice softer draw now, not a sling. Yeah, okay, yeah. and in time when that club does start working a bit more this way, you better shape the ball both ways. So then playing 11 and other holes, three on the on the, on the button. Yeah. You can down that left hand side, two on the right hand side, get the club outside your hands, hit it as hard as on the left hand side. Just a little drift fade, exactly. Just right, it goes yeah. straight, no problems. If you get a draw, well, not the end of the world, yeah. but at least you've got a chance of hitting the shot you're looking for rather yeah. than just thinking, I'm going to aim to the tree. No, I can't do it and snap it on the fifth fairway, <laughs> yeah, which is yeah. what happened on the, on the last yeah, lesson. Yeah, yeah, okay? yeah. So, yeah, that makes sense. So, that yeah. wrist hinge draw is going to be a really good one. If you can practice that, probably do that as a warm up with your nine and your wedge. Yeah. Get the first 10, 12, 15 shots, just start with the club down and just hinge the wrist up, get the club hinging up like so. Yeah. So you preset that wrist hinge and then swing from there. You get the club in a really good position. And what you generally see after doing that is the ball goes a bit to the right. Yeah. Because your path is so used to going into the right rather than yeah. coming towards target. As we said, the path of the club should be more into square to in, whereas yours goes into out sometimes. Yeah, yeah. And the more into out you get, the more hook you create. Gotcha, yeah, yeah. Makes sense? Yeah, it does make sense. Perfect, good stuff. But the hip <laughs> movement makes much better. There's a lot less slide and stuck. It's more bump and rotate, and it's yeah. less of an exaggerated yeah, move. Yeah. You're not fearful of that left shake. I'm going to try and... Ooh. I'm not using the drive so much as well, which is quite nice. I'm not hurting my hips so much. So well, exactly, yeah, yeah.